Opinions are truly split. One legal expert I spoke with says yes, what Musk and his super PAC are doing could be considered running an illegal lottery, while another says it can't be a lottery because he's giving away his own money. Last week, Tesla CEO Elon Musk was sent a letter from the Department of Justice warning him that his $1 million giveaway could violate federal law, something Richard Painter, an election law expert, believes is true. This is an indirect way of paying someone to register to vote. But Michael Domino, also an election law expert, tells us he doesn't think Musk is crossing the line. Well, it's clearly not vote buying because he's not paying anybody to vote or not to vote or to vote for a particular candidate. As for this most recent lawsuit claiming Musk's giveaway is an illegal lottery in the state of Pennsylvania, Domino believes that also isn't true. We're not selling lottery tickets. Nobody's buying a lottery ticket. Nobody's throwing money into this except for Musk. Along with running an illegal lottery, the lawsuit also accuses Musk of violating consumer protection laws, something Madeline Somerville, an attorney at Georgia Trial Consulting, believes is the case. There are specific provisions in the law that allow you to support folks getting out to vote. But if it endorses one side versus the other, that's where the state or the U.S. has to step in. Which is why Somerville says the lawsuit has been filed to put an end to the giveaway. But opinions are split about whether or not anything illegal is being done. That can't possibly be a lottery when someone's giving away his own money. In my opinion, he is operating an illegal lottery in the state of Pennsylvania. Now, according to CNN, a judge did schedule a hearing on the matter for Friday, which means the giveaway could last at least through the week. I'm Jeff Harris reporting from Washington.